Hey guys, how's it going? It's Ocean here, and today we're looking at something that's insane. So if you're like me and you play Skate or XL a lot, you know that there's some maps with insane textures, but that comes with also being like a 700 megabyte file or something. And it takes about a minute to load, maybe a bit less if you're on an SSD or M.2 drive. Now my buddy Lakaiju actually found a way to make it load super fast, like maybe five seconds or something. Like it's it's stupid fast. Uh, I'm going to show you how to do it. Usually a map for me that's big will take a minute to load. I can load it in like three seconds now. Not over exaggerating, like literally three seconds. So let's take a look at this. First off, you're going to want to go to this site right here. I'll have it linked in the description. It says seven days to die, but that's just because it also uses Unity, I'm guessing. But it works for Skater XL. So we'll download the latest release, 64-bit uh, for me. And you just hit download right there, or you can use your mega transfer if you want. Uh, after that downloads, I'm just going to save it and open it. And right here, oh, uh oh, there we go. All right, right here, we have this one file. Inside, we have the bundle extractor. So we're just going to extract this whole thing to the desktop. And uh, you can rename it to like Unity Asset Bundle Extractor if you want. But we're just going to go in. Everything keeps going to my second monitor, by the way. Uh, we're going to go to the Asset Bundle uh, Extractor EXE, hit File open and then we're going to navigate to the correct folder. Pick the map that you want and hit open. Now it's going to ask, uh, now it's going to say this bundle file is compressed. Do you wish to unpack it? And that's exactly what we want to do. So I'm just going to rename it to pretty much the same thing and then I'll just put like, uh, actually I'll put an underscore in front of it and that'll just put it to the top. So I'm going to save that and we just go ahead and wait. Don't click on uh, Unity Asset Bundle Extractor or it might freeze. Essentially you just want to wait until the file is uh, made and you'll be able to see that right in here uh, wherever your maps are uh, if I go to here or sorry fuck. so as you can see right now it's being made it's at zero kilobytes right now but once it's finished extracting then it's going to populate fully all right it just finished as you can see it's 1.8 gigabytes now and you can see that it's finished also in unity asset bundle extractor because it shows the name up there and you're able to actually click on stuff. So that's all you need from that. And you can just keep doing more maps. You can delete the original now if you want. Uh, I haven't noticed any negative effects. If you see any, um, then just you know shoot a comment down below. All right, here's how long it takes to load the original. And it has loaded, so that took about maybe 40 seconds or something. I wasn't counting, but there'll be a timer up here. So, all right, next I'm going to load the decompressed one. You'll see how big of a difference it really is. So it actually went to the bottom on this. But I can literally just talk through this. It's done. <laughs> it was literally like a second and a half or something. I don't know. But it's stupid fast. All right, so that's all there is to it. Uh, make sure to leave a comment down below with your original load time and then the new one after you've done this because it's so, so fast. It is so worth it as long as you have, you know, a little bit extra space to, uh, to store those maps. Make sure to check out this map too. It's Ghetto Spot from Skate 3. Uh, Lakaiju made this along with some modeling help from OG Hubba and I did the grind splines for it. It's a really fun map and it's nice... It's a nice little throwback to, uh, to, you know, Skate 3 back in, you know, 2012 or whenever it came out. Um, I'll leave a link down in the description to download this and also the Unity Asset Bundle Extractor. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.